I wanna show you the cheapest property that we bought this year. And in this video, I'm gonna share with you where the property is at, how much we paid, what the rental income is of the property, what the yield is, and how anyone out there, even yourself, could literally have bought this property. And by sometimes not taking action, you're missing out on amazing deals like this. This property that we bought was in the Perth location. It was only about 15 minutes to the Perth CBD. It's in a very expensive location as well, despite the affordable price. Close to shops, schools, amenities, and the beach. Like you're literally like three minutes to the beach. We bought this property on behalf of a client. We negotiated it down to just $188,000. This property just got rented for around close to $400 per week. So the yield on that is over 10%. You could get started with a property just like this with as little as 5%. So 5% of 188,000, it's like $10,000 or less, 9,000 as in terms of a deposit. Stamp duty on a $188,000 property would be about four and a half thousand. So you literally buy this property with about 15 grand. If you've got 15,000 in savings, you could have technically bought a property just like this. What's interesting and why I wanna show you this property is that next door, the complex next door, this is a unit complex, there's low strata fees, it's only about two and a half thousand per year. Now that includes the building insurance. It's cash flow positive, regardless of how you look at it. The rental income of close to 400 per week, the particular client that bought it did a 10%, so their loan would only be about 160. The repayments on $160,000 would be probably about a hundred and sixty dollars a week, roughly, depending on the interest rate and whether to go principal and interest rates only. They're getting close to $400 per week. And the remaining amount covers council rates, water rates, manager fees, and insurance. So they're still positive cash flow. When we bought the property, it was under rented, but it was only rented for around three hundred and twenty. dollars But the tenants moved out, new tenants moved in, and it's renting for close to $400 per week which is phenomenal cash flow and yield. The complex next door is identical to this. They just got renovated. And the one bedroom unit right next door to this property, almost identical, just a little bit more modern because they've been renovated now. This one's had updates done also. Four of them just got sold for $355,000 each. So you've got recent sales that are the same configuration. One bed, one bath, one car, similar size, literally in a block next door. We bought this back in March, roughly February, March, 2023. It's now September, October, 2023, six to seven months later or so. We've got comparable sales like 355,000, double the price within a year. It basically gives the client the opportunity to go back, get valuations done. Even if it comes in at 300,000, they bought it for 188. 188 to 300,000. You pull out 100,000 plus of equity and you can buy one or two or three more properties using that equity. This was the cheapest property of 2023. Now look, we buy a lot of other properties. Sometimes they're 300,000, 400, 600, 800,000 occasionally. But this one, I wanna show you the cheapest property of 2023 to show you that it is possible for anyone out there to get started with a property like this. I personally bought properties identical, just like this in my own property investing journey. If you don't believe me, check out the book 30 Properties Before 30. If you haven't read it already, the first property or even the fourth property looks identical to the one that I've just shown you here today that we picked up in 2023. That one, we've just bought it in Perth, 15 minutes to the city, close to the beach, very, very good location. I was buying the exact same similar properties, but in Brisbane, the Gold Coast and the Central Coast of New South Wales. So the, the formula, the strategy is the same. The property types are the same. The prices are the same, but we've changed the location to follow the growth cycle right now. Perth is booming and the next two or three years, if you're getting quick, there's a lot of money to be made through property investing. Thanks for watching the video. If you haven't got the book, click on the link. There'll be a link somewhere around this video to get the book for free. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.